All right, Scooby. So you want to get home? So I checked today to see how many more weeks I have left. Oh, that was just the trees. But uh, I checked. Was it this? Yeah, I believe it was this morning. How many weeks I have left that I need to well till I graduate? And it's just like 10 weeks, and they're coming by pretty quick. I'm pretty excited to start my internship next week. Looking forward to that. Wow, what the hell? Windy again when I'm walking home. We'll see for how long. Hope y'all can hear me. And I make sure I cut the volume down when it's windy. But. <clears throat> Wu-Tang Clan ain't nothing to quit. Wu-Tang Clan ain't nothing to quit. <clears throat> so finally you can actually hear me. I'm back in from work. It was busy at work as usual. Which has been the way for like the past couple of weeks, surprisingly. And <clears throat> I'm going to go by Michael's tonight. And get the sealing wax. But I'll, first I'm going to call them to make sure they even have it. And I'm going to make sure I go to bed tonight early. Well, earlier than usual. Probably like just 15 minutes early. Uh, what am I checking my bag for when I don't have anything that I need to put in the dishwasher? I'm just going to get me it. Let me get out of my work clothes. Feels so great to have a new shirt. I must say, instead of wearing a shirt with holes in it. And I don't wash my work clothes every day like I used to, which was a dumb thing for me to be doing. And it seems as if it broke down the fibers in the clothes even more, if that made any sense, or if I'm making any, saying the correct terms for that. I have not had this in a while. <clears throat> so I got some celery, noodles, peanut butter, pepper, and sriracha sauce. Should be interesting on how this is gonna taste since I have not had it in so long. I was just thinking when I was downstairs how I used to eat this every day before going into work. Oh, how have times change. But now I'm just gonna watch some Duck Dynasty and then after I'm gonna do my Aussie meal. This is gonna be so fun to do that. I've already listened to lesson two, like two or three times just to get a little bit familiar with the audio. And it's been great. I'm so glad I got the ICB course. Wow, I just checked my the tracking number for my stamp kit and it should be here today. Cause mail has probably already been delivered. So I'm gonna go outside and get that real quick. All right, so here is the everything that came. They give you a proof. Let me bring everything over here. All right, so I ordered this from Simon's Stamps. It was like twenty seven dollars of change that's including shipping and this stamp pad which the blog post it was from Nubby Twiglet she had recommended this so it was like might as well and anyways so yeah it's pretty big and there is info on the back I just got solid black and here is the proof of how the stamp looks once it's applied and I just got the regular wooden handle stamp and let me see if I can get the detail on it and it is not I have to go to another clip where it focuses in okay so here is some detail shots of it and let me sh see if I can get some detail on this if you all can see where it looks somewhat pixelated around the edges of the D right here well, it's not too bad and plus that'll give it a better more hand done look to it as well because around the J has it as well okay but everything looks pretty good to me I'm happy with how it turned out just got through eating and relaxing for a bit found what videos I'd seen on reddit one was about a pipeline leak in Montana which is crazy but 
anyways, what people were saying in the comments was that kind of stuff happens all the time with the oil companies and once they do get charged with it, it's really nothing to them because of the amount of money that they make probably within a week. And then, what other video I'd seen? It was a video of a guy in a McLaren and this guy freaking stopped traffic, turned off his car, went to take a piss, and then got back in his car and was driving away at the light and then flipped the guy off that was recording. If I was a guy, I probably wouldn't and I had blocked out the license plate. So I'll put that video in the description so you can check that out. And the oil spill, the video I talked about before that, it'll probably most likely be all over the news, just like the other one I talked about with the oil spill in Arkansas. And post some more stuff on the Facebook page, a video that you all should definitely go check out if you have not done so yet. And like the Facebook page if you haven't done so yet as well. It'll be in the description along with my Twitter and Instagram. And Instagram is getting even more fun. I enjoy it because the new project I'm doing with Instagram is taking a photo a day for 30 days of me on public transportation or just public transportation in general. All right, now I'm gonna go ahead and get started on my Aussie mail. And a message from me to you out there, to all of you out there, if you believe, if you dream and believe you can achieve, just look at me. All right, let me go ahead and get started on this now before time gets by even more and more. <sighs> Yeah, getting more sleep tonight is definitely going to be on the agenda. But I just finished doing my Aussie mail. Well, I just have one more step I need to do before I will be done. And I'm going to go back over this vocabulary anyway to get it more solid and compact. But this steps that I've been using that I found on YouTube the other day have been working great. And it's really helped me get a better grasp on the grammar vocabulary but I'm just gonna go take Scooby for a walk now I'm gonna get we'll finish up the early bird menu for one of my projects well for my portfolio I'm so psyched that the stamp cake got here today and turned out pretty good I have no complaints the way when I was talking about the detail on this earlier you're gonna have to really look up close at it but I mean, I'm happy with how it turned out. So, yo, I'll see you all tomorrow. And whoop. it's pretty good getting it back. I definitely have to put everything that he sends me in the plastic sleeves in the in the Patron case where I have like my portfolio working and and documents that really mean a lot to me. Basically, a bunch of my design work. But man, whoo! Today has.